Hello friends, I am Dr. Nilesh Chinskar, Pulmonologist and Director of the Chest Care Center. Recently, we are talking about allergic respiratory diseases. In my last video, I had given an overview regarding allergic respiratory diseases and tried to clear some common misconceptions in people's mind. Today, I will be talking on causes of allergic respiratory diseases. As you know, allergy is an exaggerated response of one's immune system to a particular substance and this substance is often called as allergen. These allergen can be specific allergen such as food items, fungus, molds, pet animals or they can be irritants such as dust, chemicals or pollutants. Now, after exposure to the allergen, it directly do not cause any symptom. Initially, it enters in a body and causes antibody production. This phase is called as phase of initial sensitization. After initial sensitization, if a person is exposed to same kind of allergen, that time that antibody comes in contact with the allergen, develops an allergen antibody complex and can give symptoms of allergy. And third phase is a latent phase that means a repeated exposure of similar kind of antigen causes chronic inflammatory condition and gives frequent symptoms of allergy. Types of allergy are usually divided by the way of their entry. The first is exposure or direct skin contact. Many animal tenders, human tender, or exposure to a poisonous plant can cause allergy. Similarly, ingestion of any food item such as milk or any dairy, dairy product, different seafoods such as seashells or prawns or any kind of food item can cause allergy. Similarly, oral drugs which we ingest can give mild to severe kind of allergy. Third way of allergy is by injection. We take medicines by injection, injectional way and this can give allergy to one particular individual. Similarly, stings given by insects such as honeybee and scorpion can cause severe allergy if any individual is allergic to it. The most common way of causing respiratory allergy is by inhalational heat. Many pollens, molds, fungus, dust mite can cause allergy by inhalational heat. Similarly, birds can also cause allergy. Pigeons and parrots are very common and known to cause allergy. Same way, animals, pet animals such as dog, cat, buffaloes can also cause allergy. So friends, these are some common allergens which can cause respiratory allergy diseases. The individual who is allergic should take care of all these things and should avoid the direct exposure to allergens. In the coming videos, we will be discussing on symptoms caused by these allergens and different diseases caused by these allergens. And most importantly, how to diagnose your allergy and how to treat it. So friends, thank you very much for the watching.